On July 10th, Tanzania in Central Africa experienced a 5.0 earthquake, rushing at a depth of 6.0 miles. And the epicenter was 4 degrees south and 35 degrees east. It puts it right in between the Serengeti, Mount Kilimanjaro, and the capital, the Doma. Now, this earthquake is a little special because usually I don't cover these earthquakes that are below a 6.0 on the modified Richter scale. However, this one is unique based on its tectonic setting. Now, it's along the eastern branch of the East African Rift Valley, which is a divergent plate boundary on land. So it's a continental rift valley or a mid-ocean ridge if it occurred under the oceans. Now, that is more common around the world. And this part of Africa is the only place where we're seeing this active divergence of a continental crust occurring in real time. And we see this African plate being slowly split over two domes of magma into two plates. The Somalian plates, the east and the west would be the African plate. Now, this earthquake is a consequence of that magma, that plume, that uprising of magma underneath the African plates, pushing the two plates apart along this divergent plate boundary and causing these very deep lakes and these two branches. And Tanzania sits right on top of that eastern branch. And this whole system extends from the Red Sea in the north all the way down to Mozambique in the south. And this is why this earthquake is cool and unique, because it doesn't really happen too often in this area. The last big earthquake in Tanzania was a 5.5 in 2019, and before that was a 6.5 in the year 2000, so 25 years ago. So this is a cool earthquake.